Also learning more about what was seized from the Pennsylvania home of Brian Koberger, the man accused in the killings of four University of Idaho students. Ross DiMatteo joins us now in the studio with the details. Good morning, Ross. Good morning to you, Jim. According to newly unsealed court documents, dark clothes, medical gloves, and a flashlight were among the items seized by state police when they arrested Koberger at his parents' Pennsylvania home back in January. Now, these records were made public yesterday, including the inventory of items that was seized by state police from his home, uh, his parents' home, I should say, in Monroe County, which is about 45 minutes north of Allentown. It includes a silver flashlight, four medical style gloves, a white t shirt, a black sweatshirt, a pair of black and white Nike shoes, and black Under Armour socks, shorts, and boxers. Now, it is still unclear what significance these items may have in this investigation, if any. According to that arrest warrant, state police also swabbed Brian Koberger's DNA from the home. The 28 year old is accused of stabbing four college students to death at the University of Idaho back in November. Koberger was a graduate student at nearby Washington State University at the time. Former Philadelphia Police Commissioner Charles Ramsey says the prosecution, based on the items that was collected, has some obstacles to overcome, but he believes they will have a strong case against Koberger in court. I think they have a pretty strong case just based on that. Uh, at least uh, circumstantial, they still don't have a murder weapon. It'd be great if they found it. Now, Koberger faces four counts of first degree murder and burglary charges as well. He hasn't said how he plans to plead to those charges. We are expecting to learn more about his arrest when more warrants are released later on today. Koberger's preliminary hearing is scheduled for late June. Jim, back to you. Thank you, Ross.